Kofler rather had a uh, partial break in front and he couldn't pull the trigger correctly. Now Ty Hemingway, a long shot, he scores! Ty Hemingway breaks the scoreless tie. It's 1-0 Delta. I mentioned earlier just how good Delta is at moving this puck, especially in the offensive zone. Hemingway, cross ice, here's Carson, back to Bow. Bow to Hemingway, a shot, and it's hit 10. They score. I don't know exactly what happened there. I think it might have gone off a Steeler player in front, redirected into the net. A power play goal for the Delta Ice Hawks, and it's nutted up at two. It's down low. Cole couldn't handle it, though, just out of his reach. Now Warburton went for the sharp angle shot off the side of the net. Warburton muscled off the puck. Falso had a stick in the midsection again. It's the second time tonight that Falso's had a stick in his midsection. Petrie shot on the ice, tipped in front, they score! What a nifty tip there by Cullen Jang. A power play goal, and the Ice Hawks have restored their one goal lead. What an absolutely fantastic setup there by Petrie. Brandon Petrie can give the able to play with a shot, and I think they're not stronger than this one now. I thought Hunter Morgan's played actually rather well himself. There's a shot in front, and the Delta Ice Hawks! Tie it up right off the face off. A nifty backhander at the far side post coming out of the pile. It looks like it's gonna be Colin Jang, his second of the game. Now Petrie is in the 12th shootout. Brandon Petrie in on the left side. Petrie shoots and scores! Brandon Petrie in the 12th round wins this game, the first of the season for the Delta Ice Ox, and the rivalry will continue. They went the distance for this win and just came out of it against the scrappy Grand Views team.